Hello, everyone. My name is Dr. Paul Miller, and I'm the Professional Development Director for the Office of E-Learning, Innovation, and Teaching Excellence at Montgomery College. This five-part video series is to support teaching and learning in a digital age and explores the four C's of 21st century learning. Those C's are communication, collaboration, critical thinking, and creativity. At the end of this introductory video, you will have the option to explore a video about each one of the four C's. In this five-part series, we will learn about the four C's of 21st century learning, critical thinking, communication, collaboration, and creativity. After an initial overview of the four C's of 21st century learning in session one, each C will be explored in subsequent sessions, offering practical advice and strategies to support the continuum of teaching and learning. Upon completion of this series, you will be able to identify the competencies of each of the four C's, evaluate your existing pedagogical strategies that support the development of each skill, and access resources to enhance opportunities for future integration within your teaching and learning process. 21st century learning is a term used to describe education that is not based on traditional teaching methods. It involves the students developing key skills that are important to develop for our ever-changing world. This type of learning is not memorization or about studying for a test. It is real-world collaborative and invokes critical thinking. To meet the needs of the new 21st century learner, we must empower learners by cultivating their voice and agency. We must empower learners to use their voice to influence change and to give them autonomy within the learning environment that allows for choice and differentiation based on strengths, needs, skills, and interests. To achieve success, the interplay between the development and use of 21st century skills and rigorous academic content must be purposefully planned and integrated within the educational setting for deeper learning to occur. Learning not only for academic success at Montgomery College, but to become lifelong learners and contributors in our rapidly changing world. Over the past 20 years, there have been a lot of talk about 21st century skills and their place in education. Although each of the 12 21st century skills can be placed into one of three categories, we are going to focus on learning skills, critical thinking, collaboration, communication, and creativity. More information about literacy and life skills can be found using the link on the screen. Again, the purpose of this video is to identify and understand each of the four C's. In each subsequent session, additional information and practical strategies will be provided to support their intentional integration within your professional context. So let's begin with critical thinking. As defined by the dictionary, critical thinking is the analysis of facts to form a judgment. Critical thinking within education involves the process of information and discovery, interpretation and analysis, reasoning and problem solving. Our students need to develop deductive and inductive reasoning to understand situations that support their content development. By gathering relevant information and asking questions that clarify points of view, as students can solve problems and make informed decisions, as well as use appropriate criteria when making choices. We know as a society that people learn in communities and through experiences. Together, we can accomplish more than as simply individuals and have more fun in the process. Students are no different. When students collaborate, they have an opportunity to discuss new concepts with someone close to their own level of understanding. They get to try out new ideas and ask questions in small groups before speaking to the whole class or finishing a product or assignment. Through cooperation, students develop a sense of responsibility, learn how to construct and give appropriate feedback, and develop their leadership skills. 
However, collaboration is only possible when effective communication is present. When students communicate effectively, they learn to listen to others, deliver oral presentations, engage in conversations and discussions, and support arguments with claims. This not only supports the four C's of 21st century learning, but also reinforces the notion that in the end, the responsibility for learning still rests with them as they learn to communicate their ideas and share information through writing, speaking, and digital media, all of which support personal and group learning. The last of our four focus learning skills is creativity. Creativity is the ability to generate, design, and foster new and unique ideas. Thinking creativity means looking at things from different perspectives, not restricted by rules, customs, or norms. Having the courage to explore and fail in order to improve and maximize creative efforts is key in finding solutions to today's problems. Innovation is born from creativity. However, it is the interdependence of the four C's that we will explore in the upcoming sessions. As we wrap up session one, I invite you to take a brief self-assessment of the four C's based on the information presented and your current efforts to integrate them within your class. The self-assessment will ask you to reflect on your current teaching practices and will serve as a baseline for your future learning and application of the information presented.